Well, we begin this afternoon with a man being wounded after being shot by police during a tense situation on Indy's north side. Thanks for joining us here first at four. I'm Nick McGill. And I'm Eric Graves in for Lee this afternoon. Fox 59's Jesse Wells spoke to police and has the very latest on the investigation. Police were first called to the scene to check the welfare of a woman they believe was being held hostage. When police arrived, they say they exchanged gunfire with the suspect. Luckily, it does not appear anyone died during that violence. Around 1130 in the morning, along River Drive near Keystone, IMPD says a woman called 911 and reported another woman was being held hostage inside an apartment. First officers on scene attempted to make contact with the people inside. After a short time, the officers heard a female scream and an officer saw a man inside with a gun. When officers forced their way into the apartment, they say the suspect opened fire and officers returned fire, wounding the shooter. Luckily, IMPD says neither their officers or the woman inside the apartment were injured. I'm so thankful that none of our officers were injured during this incident. I'm extremely grateful that the um, female involved received the help that she needed and she is unharmed. And I just want to champion those who called and intervened and stood up when someone in this community was in danger. Police say they did recover this gun just a few feet away from where the suspect was shot. Finally, the two officers who were involved in the shooting have been placed on routine administrative leave while the case is investigated. Jesse Wells, Fox 59 News. Thank you very much.